Hello, I've missed you all so very much, and I know a lot of you have reached out to me how much you miss my videos and my food finds. So that's what I'm here today for. I have a good amount of food finds, and um, as far as my situation with um, the medicine, we are we decided to switch it so. Um, I will let you know what happens after a week of me being off of the medicine because my weight literally does not move, um, following the program and as you know, that is super frustrating. I don't know of anything that's more <laughs> frustrating than trying really hard and then it's not working. So, that's that. I will keep you posted on that. And, um, I'm going to get into my food finds because I have quite a few. Um, but I just want to let you guys know that, um, again, I'm not going anywhere. Um, you know, I, you know, I'm here to stay. And it's, it's just so funny. Someone was telling me the other day that they they lost a bunch of weight and people started saying, "Oh, you're looking too skinny." Your, you know, family was telling them that their head was too big for their looking too big for their body and all this. So, they decide to gain, I think, like 10 pounds. So, you know, they would look a little, I guess, their head wouldn't be bigger than their body. Who knows? And <clears throat> so they gained 10 pounds, you know, slowly. And then the next thing you know, people and family are saying, <clears throat> oh my gosh, um, oh, she going off her program? You know, and then they start with that. So it's like, come on, you know? And I know a lot of you have been there because... It's just, that's, a, that's just how it is. Um, I have been crazy overwhelmed with doing things and running around and um, I've been spending a lot of time with my family and working and it's just, it's been crazy. I literally just, sorry for my hair today, <clears throat> I you know, threw on, um, some makeup and, you know, did my hair just a little bit just so I could come on camera just to show you my food finds because a lot of you said that it helped you. And so that bothers me that I'm not doing videos, not helping you. So, and the video that I'm working on is going to be a low carb. It's, it's not completely, um, carbless, but, and it's not like Atkins or anything like that, but it's on the lower carb side and lower sugar side. So I think a lot of you will enjoy that. Um, that's a full day of food and it'll give you some ideas if you want to do a day like that. So let me get into my food finds and, um, let's just get started. So the first thing that I wanted to share was this is Blue Diamond Almond Breeze and it has a little bit <clears throat> of honey in it. It's 50 calories per serving for one cup and it's two points. This is really good in cereal, drink it plain, put it in a shake, whatever you want to do. But this is in most stores. I've seen it in Walmart. I've seen it in Target. I've seen it in Giant. So you can pretty much find this anywhere. So I just wanted to show you because this was a new um, flavor, I guess. They put in a hint of honey. So the next thing, which is one of my favorite new food finds, um, this is light and fit Greek yogurt. I'm trying to get the lighting right. They are a hundred calories and as you see it's chocolate on top. Now this flavor is vanilla and there's literally like 
a coating of chocolate on top of the yogurt. So you mix it up or you don't mix it up. If you're weird like me, you'll scrape all the chocolate aside and then like eat the yogurt and then eat the chocolate. Just like me with cake with icing. <laughs> Same deal. So um, anyway, that is Light and Fit by Dannon. And they're three points. And of course, as I said, 100 calories. And I also wanted to show you the other flavors. They also have a banana one. Same thing, light and fit. I found these at Giant Food Store. I'm sure they're probably at Walmart. And one other flavor that I found, which is strawberry. And they all have... They're all 100 calories, and they all have 11 grams of protein. So, um, anyway. So this tastes like strawberries with chocolate on top. It's delicious. So, I usually have like one of those a day. Probiotics are super good for you if you don't take a vitamin, especially. Well, I do both. I take the vitamin, and then I also, um, my... Um, the vitamin that I take that a lot of you have also um, found on my blog and picked up, that is like, it has billions of probiotics, which is so good for your digestive system, it's not even funny. So, that's that. Next item. Um, this is uh, Brookside Dark Chocolate Acai and Blueberries. Let me get this right. Ugh. I hate when the sun starts to go down, but this was the only time that I could film. So, now, I wasn't going to pick these up. Well, not this box. They come in a big bag, and you can tend to just hold on to the bag if you don't count them out first. So, I got these. These come in little packets. See the packets on the back? And... Each little packet is only 90 calories and two points. So that's fabulous. And of course, uh, they're on the healthy side. They have dark chocolate and acai berry, um, blueberries. So good for you and delicious. If you're really looking for something like chocolatey, these definitely do the job. So, they come in packets, measured out, found these at Giant Food Store, but they're probably everywhere else as well. So, that is that. Fiber One came out with some new uh, bars. Now, this is Fiber One Cheesecake Bar. This thing, okay, so it's 150 calories per bar. This one is salted caramel, and oh my god, it is absolutely amazing. It's very moist. The strip down the middle is, I mean, it looks like, just like it looks on the box. It's so moist, delicious. The strip down the middle is amazing. It has a little bit of icing on top. These are so, so good. If you're really looking for something sweet, because these are very sweet, and they're four points. So, I don't like that they're four points, but who does? I want everything to be one point or zero. But anyway, these are delicious if you're really looking for something that, um, that just really satisfies your sweet tooth. And this is another new one. And this was cheesecake with um, strawberry down the middle. I do like the salted caramel better. This is the same deal, 150 calories and 4 points. And of course they put their fiber in there, 5 grams of fiber. So these are delicious as well, but me and my salted caramel, I just can't part with it. The next thing I wanted to show you, where did it go? Alright, um, hopefully you have a Giant or any store brand really. 
these I found at Giant Food. They're frozen Greek yogurt bars. They do have probiotics in them. They're actually frozen yogurt, not ice cream frozen or anything like that. They are 90 calories and three points. So these are delicious and they're as big as they show on the package, which like old packaging, you guys probably remember, you get the packaging and you see this thing in there that's like this big like this bar and then you get it home and it's like, <sighs> and you're like, really? So anyway, next I want to show you some ice creams <clears throat> that are super helpful, super helpful, super helpful in the summertime. And for any time, really, because they're so low. So these are fudge sickle, 40 calories. They are one point a piece. I usually eat two of them for two points. So they're delicious, and I think they are sugar-free. 80 calories, and they're like, oh my gosh, they were like a dollar fifty at Giant Food Store. So made by fudge sickle. So that one's that one, that one's that one. And if you like Tootsie Roll Pops, this is a new Popsicle. It's like a Tootsie Pop. The outside is either orange or, you know, whatever, raspberry, cherry, whatever they, what, whatever flavors they come in. And then the inside is actually chocolate. So these are brand new. They are only 45 calories per um, each one, and they're a pretty good size. I would definitely say to pick these up if you like ice cream and you like something that is low in points, because one point is nothing for this bar. So this is a really, really good find. Um, did I tell you it was 45 calories? Yeah, I think so. So anyway. If you can find those, I found those at Giant Food as well. Again, I think that Popsicle brand is like everywhere. Um, let's see. Another find is these I actually bought for my son. And these are Honey Made Gramfuls. Gramfuls? Yeah. And they are s'mores. And as you can see, they have like chocolate and marshmallow in there, and it's like a little sandwich kind of thing. They come individually wrapped for 110 calories and three points. These are well worth it if you're looking for a snack like this. Um, they're they're just easy and they're delicious. So, and it says excellent source of calcium, but. And they're made with 100% um, whole grain. Whatever that means. If you notice, I'm a little red and I'm a little shiny. It's really hot in here. And we we don't have central air, but we have like the window, um, the window ones. And it's just right now, it's just not working for me. So anyway, next find. These are. Um, by Kashi, and I don't know if they've been out for a while, but these are chocolate almond butter. Delicious, they're humongous, made by Kashi, and they're on the healthier side. And let's see, they are 130 calories per cookie and three points, but that is one big cookie. I mean, it like pretty much like fills you up. Not fills you up, but it makes you feel like, you know, you have something in your stomach. And my last two exciting things that I saved for last, of course, is first I'm going to show you this. Um, this is by Jif. They came out with peanut butter powder, just like PB2. This is brand new. What I like about it is that it's 70 calories and three tablespoons is two points. 
So the PB2, I think it goes up another point. I'm not sure, but I think so. So three tablespoons is 70 calories and two points. Yes, two points. So look for this. They've also come out with a chocolate peanut butter, which I want to pick up. I'm actually going to get all the peanut butter powders and I'm going to try them all, let you know which one is the best. This one does not taste as good as PB2, but it's very close. So, I mean, I don't know how it doesn't because it's, anyway. But they even have a little recipe for a smoothie back here, skim milk, ripe banana, three tablespoons of Jif, um, and ice cubes. So, you can try a little shake for yourself if you want. And last but not least, I found this at Walmart. <clears throat> okay. This screams my name. This is brand new. They just came out with this. I saw this at Wawa as well. And Giant Food. These are sweet and salty. And they are just like combo pretzels. They have like the salt on the outside, but on the inside is vanilla frosting. So, which is crazy. And why didn't I write the points on this? Hold on. Let's get out there. So I want you guys to let me know while I'm looking this up. I want you to let me know what you think. Um, how you've been doing and um, how your summer's going, if you've been crazy busy, if, you know, just want to know what's going on in your life. I know I don't get to respond a lot to your messages and that's just because right now, like I said, in the summer, it's just, it's been an overwhelming time for me, I have to say. And... See, protein. I don't know why I didn't write this on here. Okay, it's four points for one third cup, one ounce. So it's a pretty good um, amount for 130 calories <clears throat> and for four points because you eat them really slow. Well, the way I eat them is I eat the outside, of course, of the pretzel. And then, of course, I eat the vanilla frosting. If you are one of those people where you can't have stuff like that in the house, then do not pick those up because they are really, um, really tempting. They will end the fiber one bars, but you can always get someone to hide them or put them in the freezer so they're out of sight. And, um... If you have not been on track, get back on track. It's so easy. It just takes, it's not so easy, but it just takes a commitment to start tomorrow or start right now and just start doing it. Start tracking your points. You know, sometimes people get lost. They feel like, what do I do now? Just start tracking again. That's all that you need to do. Um, as far as willpower, that's another story, but anyway, you can do it. Um, you know, I've been struggling with this issue, and I'm still, I've been on track, and I, I still, you know, I'm going to make it to my goal, no matter what, and that is just my mentality. It's very important to me. It is, um, it's, it's, it's just so important to me that I'm going to do it and I'm going to get there no matter what it takes. Whatever I have to switch around, whatever I have to do, if I have to start working out even more, then that's what I'm going to do because it's really important to me to be happy and to feel happy about myself and, and healthy. So... Um, just like I said in one of my posts on Facebook, if you have a bad day at work or even a bad week, I've had bad weeks, I've had bad days, but 
you don't quit your job just because you had a bad day or a bad week. You go back and you try to make for a better day or a better week. And some days you have like a sort of, you know, bad, maybe it might start out bad at work and then it gets better. Same thing with your diet plan. You, you just roll with the punches and take it as it comes and put yourself back on track and stay there. Just, just stay there and just keep on, you know, surrounding yourself with motivation. So, again, print out the thing that I put on my blog. I repeat it that every day. I still repeat it. And it just reinforces good behavior and positive thoughts and all that stuff. So, all right, I think I've, you've heard enough of me talking for today. I love you guys so much, and I have missed you like crazy. Thank you for all your messages, and I will see you very soon. All right, have a fabulous week, and... Um, Comment below. Let me know how you've been doing. I would love to know. All right? Love you guys. Bye. Mwah.